Hi, I'm Kai and today I'm at ePlan and want to talk about the solutions and services ePlan provides in the field of education. They have special services and solutions for educators and students. And therefore I have two special guests here on my channel, Rilana and Hi. Stefan. Thanks. Rilana, can you introduce yourself? Yes, of course. I'm Rilana Sassi from ePlan and I'm responsible for ePlan education. So I take care of all matters around schools, universities and vocational training. Stefan? Yes, my name is Stefan Mahnemann. I work at the BBS2 in Wolfsburg and I take care for ePlan with my students in the class. Yeah, Rilana, I'm really interested in the solutions ePlan provides for educators and students because education is a really important topic nowadays. Mm -hmm. And as far as I know, everything is for free. So can you give us a few insights about the education solutions from ePlan? Yes, of course. Uh, ePlan Education is our eCut software solution for uh, teaching students. So we can bring our industry solutions such as ePlan Electric P8 into the classrooms. So students can really learn uh, on a practical way with real solutions with their teachers. That sounds good. That means a special license for students and teachers. Mm -hmm. That's right. Uh, students can download a student license. This is called ePlan Education for Students. And um, we have a different uh, solution for our teachers, our classroom licenses, which can be ordered at ePlan. That means you need to make a progress on your website. Mm -hmm. Can you maybe show us a little bit how to register for the license and where we can find it? Yes, of course, we can have a look at this. Rilana, before you go into the details, um, what's the difference between the student version and the classroom version for teachers? Good question. So um, the classroom version for teachers is always a network license that is installed on the school's uh, computers. Mm -hmm. We have 35 seats. Mm -hmm. um, and we deliver these licenses together with training and installation. Mm -hmm. And teachers can also use our support hotline. The student version, ePlan Education for Student, mm -hmm. is a download license from our website. This mm -hmm. is um, limited to 40 schematic pages and three years. Mm -hmm. And it is compatible to the classroom license, but both education licenses are not compatible to our industry solutions. So if you use uh, ePlan Electronic P8, for example, in your company, and you want to exchange data with the student, this is not possible mm. because the data formats are non-compatible. Apart from that, the look and feel of our education mm. software is the same okay. as you know it from our mm. industry versions. So students can really learn um, real time on, on the real software and discover the full functionalities of our platform. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. So let's have a look. Um, how a student can register an education license. The student will start on our website, so maybe he came here by Google or he was looking on our website. He discovers our ePlan Education for Students website and scrolls down to this button, Download ePlan Education. This will lead directly to um, our ePlan.com mask where he has to create an ePlan ID. So let's choose a new account and create it together. The next step will be that um, we have to confirm our registration in our email program and then we can continue with the registration. That basically works like all other registrations, so that means have a look in your email postbox and check the spam if you don't receive the email, right? Exactly. Okay, after we have confirmed this email, um, we will automatically be redirected to this page where we have to fill out our registration form. So let's fill it out together. Um, let's put in my data from ePlan. So we are in Monheim. And here we have to fill out the country or region. And this is very important because this will also determine the language that the software will initially start with. So for now, I will choose United States, even though we are not really there. <laughs> Our educational institution, we could choose, for example, the school from Stefan Mahnemann, yes. the technical school in Wolfsburg. And our course of studies is electrical engineering. My student ID, I don't have one and many other students don't have one. Is this something that you experience as well? Yes. Is it an issue? Mm -hmm. 
Uh, we hear this also. So at this point, if you have a student ID, please fill it in. But if you don't have one, please fill in the name of your course teacher, the one that teaches ePlan to you. So for now, I will put in uh, Mr. Mahnemann. My display language, this is for ePlan.com, um, is US English. And here I can choose uh, which version I want to download. So for now, of course, I take the latest available version, which is 2025 at this moment. We have to agree to the usage of our data and to the ePlan Cloud terms of use. And then we just click Create ePlan ID and it's already finished. Let's have a look if it worked. Right here, if we click on Entitlement IDs, we can see we have a license created, which is valid until three years from now. And this is valid for version 2025. And according to this Entitlement ID, this will unlock your license in the system. According to this, I am not now able to download ePlan Education version 2025 and below 2024. So to get started with our software, we choose Download and then continue with the installation. After the software is installed, um, we unlock our license via using the license activation. So we choose online activation of a single license and fill in our entitlement ID. After this, even education is already unlocked and we can get started. Quick and easy. Just in case I have already signed up for the ePlan Cloud and I have already a profile mm -hmm. and have not applied for an eID. Mm -hmm. Is there something I have to yeah, look at when I want to register later for the eID? Yes, good question. And that's not a problem. So sometimes um, students have already created an ePlan ID, but they don't have a student registration now. And I can show you how you can do this afterwards as well. So in this case, you also go to the website, our student website, click on Download ePlan Education. But now, other than before, we don't create a new ePlan ID, but we choose this line below, Download ePlan Education with existing ePlan ID. Oh, okay, yeah. And when I click here, I can sign in with my existing email address. Um, and then afterwards, we can see our registration form that we can fill in now. Okay. Once we send this, we have a new ePlan Education student license created and in our entitlement IDs. Okay, yeah, then we have clarified this. Um, if you have further questions about the whole process or the education solutions, are there any links or others um, what you can provide to help students to, for the registration or how to use ePlan? Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. So for the beginning on our ePlan Education student website, we have included a short video about the registration process, which I recommend to follow along step by step to avoid any mistakes. Um, then, of course, also on our website, you can see we have included uh, a section of frequently asked questions with the most important and most asked questions that maybe will already answer the questions the student has. And if this all is not helpful, of course, please contact us directly. So we have created an email inbox, especially for students. This is education at eplan.de. You can write us in German or English. This is totally fine and we will help you. One question from my side, how can I register as a teacher or school? How is that process? Mm -hmm. It's a little bit different. So the teacher cannot download the student license. Mm. But if you're interested in um, implementing ePlan in your courses at school, then please just contact us, mm -hmm. maybe via website. So you can choose our ePlan Education for Classrooms website mm. and contact us via the contact form. Or you can also use the education email address. Okay. And then we will get the whole process started. So yeah. for you as a, as, as a school, mm. you will receive a whole package, not only the download version, but you will receive a package of network licenses, 35 seats for mm. your classroom, a single additional license for your teacher. Mm -hmm. um, you will have one week of training and one day mm. of installation support. So we can get you started with the initial setup of the software. Additionally, uh, we also have uh, the support included for teachers. Okay. So you can always use the technical mm. support if you have any questions or occur any issues. 
um, that was helpful for me. And um, how can I place further questions in my startup process? Of course, you can contact us if you quest have questions, but mm. to help you get started with ePlan software in yeah. your courses, we have prepared several options to help mm. you. So the first step will always be a training for the teacher. This is very important from our point of view because we really want to have the teacher um, have a really good basic knowledge that he can give and um, give forward to the students. Mm. After this, additionally, we have also prepared a series of e-learnings, mm. which the teacher can use to prepare himself for the school, and he can use this also as a structure for his lessons. So to make this a little bit easier, we have created a handbook for teachers, and um, this will include tips and tricks on how to include e-plan, e-learnings into your lessons, and which topics we would recommend to start with in a beginner course. Okay, thanks. I always recommend also to take uh, the basic training. This is a good base for the learning curve of e-plan. But Stefan, I also recommend you the ePlan help. So mm -hmm. press F1 okay. on your keyboard. It's always yes. really helpful. Mm. If you have further questions about this, please write it down in the comment. We try to answer it very quickly. If you liked the video, please drop a like. Don't forget to subscribe and activate the notifications. And I hope to see you in the next video from Kai, Elana and Stefan. <laughs>